and obviously a really frustrating night tonight, I guess. Yeah, uh, great opportunity for us. Um, you know, last year we had a great run and um, there was a chance to do the same again tonight, but you know, I think there was too many um, below par tonight and you know, we got punished in the end. A lot of changes, but it, had, it did start well doing it the first sort of half hour. You were in control of it, having all the chances and, and then took the lead um, to a wonderful goal from Carlos. Yeah, it felt... Um, Oh, yeah, felt comfortable, you know, felt fully in control and, you know, that, that counter-attack um, where they scored the first goal, you know, that's what obviously what they'd set up to do and, um, you know, it was just a little bit naive not taking a yellow card on the halfway line or probably not even get that at that stage of the game, so, um, stop that counter and from then on, yeah, we, we've been punished, so, um, yeah, but like you said, great goal by Carlos, um, shame for him that he was the second best goal of the night. <laughs> Say. Obviously, you're going, to, you're going a little bit, but was, was, was the, the timing of the the, the, the goal they, they pulled back so quickly was that a bit of a, a, bit of a blow really to concede so quickly after you scored? Yeah, of course. You know, we, as soon as, as soon as you score, you want to lock down the hatches and just get through the next ten minutes. But wasn't to be. Um, I think Burke and H are on a little bit different wavelengths. You know, I don't think H is used to playing there uh, so often. So. Um, yeah, it, I think they're on a little bit different wavelengths and the boys got in and, and done a nice finish, but, you know, if you straight after you score, you, you just want to lock down and, and, you know, don't get punished like we did. You were in the first half, um, but then the second half um, on target, talk us through your goal. You know, I, I've been telling the strikers it's not all about the power, sometimes you just got to pass it in the corner. Um, so that's what I've done tonight, just passed it in the, in the top corner, you know. It's not as easy as I made it look, but it's... One of them, isn't it? <laughs> Overlapping, obviously. I mean, you don't often really uh, score a goal like that, really. So, I mean, it must be pleasing to see it going into a corner as well. Yeah, I can't remember the last time I was overlapping down the left wing, if I'm being honest. But, you know, I enjoyed it tonight. You know, it's great for me to be out there. Um, you know, just love playing football. And, you know, it's been frustrating start to the season, not not being involved in the first two games. And I think that's why it's really disappointing now that, you know, this this cup could have been perfect opportunity to try and force my way in the team and, and this over after one game, which is, uh, which is really annoying. But, um, yeah, not, not much else to say on that. Do you have any on your left before? Pardon? Score many on your left, or is that, is that a rarity? I think that's my first left-footed goal, actually. <coughs> um, yeah, so take it. I'm going to get, get some footage of it and show, show the old man. Uh, he didn't travel tonight, so um, he's messaged me, he said, so well done on that, but he, he hasn't had a chance to see it. So and they equalised again, don't they? Within about two minutes. So just, just holding on to the lead this evening could prove like a, a massive downfall, didn't it? Yeah, yeah. Um, you know, fair play to Newport. Um, you know, they they done they came here and done a job, and you know they're they're in the hat for the next round, but. A bit really disappointing for us. Like I said, it's a great opportunity to get another run going, and we just couldn't do that. Like I said, I think too many below par performances today. Not enough that can say, you know what, well, I've, I've given the gaffer food for thought here, um, and ultimately we've been punished because of it. You made some changes as well through the second half. You're going to go on strong for the end, and they just got through for the winner, didn't they, with about 15 to go and just couldn't really get back into it after that. Yeah, and like I said, fair play to Newport, they came and done a job, but we should never have left ourselves in that position to, 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 to be honest in the first place. But um, yeah, all credit to them. Obviously, we're going to have a, a debrief on it and, and um, look to go again on Saturday. Um, but yeah, d disappointing one tonight. So we'll, we'll do our debrief, draw a line under it, see what where we can improve, and then um, we'll full focus on Saturday. As you touched on, that's the main frustration that you had the chance, and I didn't you were all the players out there to get in the first team manager's thoughts, and, and it's just not really gone gone how you wanted it. No, exactly. Um, perfect opportunity. You can play as many reserve games as you want, but. We played one last Tuesday, and you know it's, it's an under 23s game. At the end of the day, it's it's a good fitness exercise, but it's not it's not a competitive game like it was tonight. So it's a shame that, that we're out of this now because, like I said last year, it was brilliant for us boys to um, almost force our way into the team. But um, yeah, now now we're out of it, and, and the chances will be few and far between now. And there's some real competition in half, isn't it? Obviously, games back now, and Sunny and Dan have started well this season so far. So there's. It's hard to get back into that back three, isn't it? Yeah, you're telling me. Frustrating, isn't it? Fair play to the boys, though. Um, you know, whoever he picks, it's, it's not their fault he picks them, so they've got my full support wherever he picks. So, um, yes, it hurts, but, you know, I'm, I'm a team player at the end of the day, and do I wish he was picking me? Yeah, of course I do, but whoever goes out there, they've got my full support. And he's 
there's a chance now put it back to uh, back here again on Saturday. So um, and get a result there, and it kind of maybe makes it a little bit easier, I suppose. Yeah, of course. Yeah, that's the good thing about football. Games come thick and fast, and things can be forgotten, and you can move on really quick. So we'll, we'll like I said, do our debrief. Full, full steam towards Saturday, you know, that's going to be no easy task. I think they've got two draws as well, so um, yeah, it can be a good battle. Uh, and hopefully we come out on top and um, then, then we try, try and get some run going.